10 seconds. Go for main engine start. Seven, six, five. Three engines up and burning. Three, two, one. And liftoff of Space Shuttle Discovery, beginning America's new journey to the moon, Mars, and beyond. And the vehicle has cleared the tower. Discovery. Houston's now controlling. Commander Ali Collins confirming Discovery's rolling onto a course for rendezvous with the International Space Station. Traveling at 400 miles per hour. Altitude 12,000 feet. This is a view from a camera mounted on Discovery's external fuel tank. Three engines on Discovery are now throttling down to two-thirds throttle to prepare the spacecraft to pass through the area of maximum air pressure and go supersonic. One minute since launch, Discovery speed now 900 miles per hour. Discovery Houston, go at throttle up. All systems remain go for Discovery. Altitude now nine miles, six miles northeast of the launch pad. Speed now 2,000 miles per hour, altitude 18 miles, 14 miles northeast of the Kennedy Space Center. Standing by now for burnout and jettison of the twin solid rockets. Forty miles downrange from the Kennedy Space Center. All continuing to go well. Altitude 67 miles, 350 miles northeast of the Kennedy Space Center. Discovery speed now 9,200 miles per hour. Discovery is rolling to a heads up position now to assist its performance as it uh, finishes its ascent to orbit. Those calls that Discovery could reach its planned orbit on only two engines if needed. All three continue to operate well at full throttle. All normal with the cutoff of Discovery's main engines. Discovery performing a maneuver to fire its jets and ensure a clean separation from the tank. Discovery, we have a good plus X maneuver. Copy the good plus X. We saw a nominal Miko. Ohms 1 is not required.